It's time for the moment you've been waiting for. On my way to Gainesville to go run in one full circle. It'll be a fun time. Got my outfit of the day. Green shirt and pants. Also got my water, like usual. Gotta save that water money. Just got off the flight. I wanted to go to the weight room. I got to the hotel, do some bike and stretching and core just to get the blood flowing again. For dinner, it looks so scrumptious. Mm. Pretty good. Honestly, the picture online looked a little better, but oh well. Gotta get some good fuel in. I don't know if that was enough food. I might have to go dip out this hotel and, you know, explore the city, see if I can find some more. Cause I ain't gonna cut it. Night vlog. Good morning guys. It's nine o'clock in the AM. Just woke up. About to go get some breakfast and start the day. It's a great day to be great. All right y'all, just got lunch. Got Kaba bowl. Man, this is the most bored I've ever been in a track meet. My roommate's not here yet, so I've just been chilling. The most interesting thing that happened today was some people got in a fight at the line at Cava about cutting the line. Order for the day, we got chicken and pickled onions and tomato and, and rice and lentils and all that good stuff. Give it a 10 out of 10. Pre-meat. Pre-meat day. Every time I go to this track, all I remember is during the 4x4s, four they always used to be doing the little Florida Gator chomp. And it would annoy me so much. I swear I'll go plus one second or minus one second faster on my four by four split. So hot out here. Gotta put water where my hands are, it's so hot. <laughs> Steeple pit is my number one enemy. One time it was raining real hard at a meet. I couldn't see anything and I missed up and fell in during my warm-up jog. Went knee deep in the water in front of a whole nother team camp. It was, it was really embarrassing. Finished with pre-meet and I'm back at the hotel. Did my blocks and mobility and all that stuff. Yes, sir. Good morning, vlog. Did a shake out in the hotel hallway. <laughs> Time for brekkie. Mm -hmm. Just chilling, watching TV, relaxing before the competition. Got my outfit of the day, ready to head out to the competition. Pizza. Oh shoot, the delivery guy ate a slice. Psyched, that was me. Huh. Alright. Mm. Bye bye, Florida. Where are we now? Georgia. Hello, Georgia. Gas station snacks. I spent $27 on the beef jerky. This better be the best beef jerky I've ever ate in my life. 
Welcome to South Carolina. Go Home Cox. to the palm trees. Go dogs. Hey guys, we're finally back. It was a long trip home. I actually flew on the way there, but because all the flights were getting delayed and crazy, I, I drove with the friend back, so that took like five and a half hours. But yeah, we're finally back now. Anyways, it was some good racing this weekend. I feel really good about the progress I made. Um, I really wanted to try something new and going out slower. I uh, probably went through the 200 a little bit too slow, but I kind of just wanted to see it through and try it out. I think I went like 21, probably 21 mid to 21 high, which is different from my 20.9, 21 flat. Um, but that third 100, I had so much energy, I just made a, a big move to get back in. Um, and then I felt like I had a lot more coming home up until the last 20. Keep working on that and training um, and racing and it'll get better. So yeah, I'm happy with the, the progress made this weekend. Um, I was happy to see some of my splits between the four 100s um, get better in certain parts. So that might be my last race of the season, but we'll, we'll see. Um, I'm still looking at some possibilities uh, for the next couple of weeks, so stay tuned. Moose, 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 say hi. Say hi. Okay. <laughs>